Finally, let's cover the new content included in the free version 3.0 update. Make your own stages and try them out immediately with the new Stage Builder. In handheld mode, you can freely draw using the touchscreen. Create moving platforms, spinning platforms, whatever strikes you. There are even new stage elements to choose from. And there are front and back layers. By changing layers, you can add decorative elements to your stages. When you finish a stage, you can battle there by selecting it from this tab on the stage select screen. Now you can import videos saved to your Nintendo Switch system to a timeline and splice them together. Editing is very simple. Just pick the parts you want to keep, add some background music, and subtitles, and choose how to transition from scene to scene. Once your video is complete, simply export it. You could keep it all to yourself, but creations are meant to be shared, aren't they? You can view gameplay videos and stages created and uploaded by users around the world. Beyond viewing players' videos and replays, you can also upload and download Mii Fighters in stages. If you find something you like, give it a yeah! Or you can even follow the person who posted it. Smash World is a service found in the Nintendo Switch Online app for smart devices. The app already supports voice chat. And now, you'll be able to easily view recommended videos and stages in Smash World without starting up the game. You can also search for videos by fighter. Recommended stages can be viewed in one place. If you find some you like, simply tap the queued downloads button. The next time you start up Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, you'll be able to download them to your system. You can also check in-game notifications here. Or create a new spirit team by using spirits in your collection. 